this is the easiest way to remove a cat from any car. I've always done this, it always comes out awesome. First you would remove the cats, okay? On this, on this car, the Mercedes, I have two cats. I have the front cats, I have the rear cats, okay? I don't want to remove the front yet, because if I remove the front, I'll get the check engine light. So I don't want that, I want to remove just the rear one. What you're going to do, you're going to cut a square window from here, up to the side and bottom. Then you just bend it back like a door. Okay, I'm gonna show you. I'm already doing the one already. See this one here? All I did, look carefully, it's not cut there. It's only cut from this corner to over here, from here, from here. You break out what's inside, you empty it out. So you have that, you get this window, you close it back, and you weld it all around. All right, so you see, I already emptied the cats already. It's be nice and empty. Now we're gonna get this door. We're gonna close it and then weld it. I'll take more videos when I'm done. Okay? Hey guys, that's the finished product. That's exactly how it should look. After that, you get it on, mount it on, and you have cats to eat. If you can't get to these angles, I know some cats, you know, if you have a flange right here, so you could poke it with a stick and get it out. But for example, this one, it's impossible. So instead of cutting the pipe, you need to align and put it on. It's got a simple little window, empty it out, and it's gonna bolt on just like factory. And the good thing is I did this on the top side, so you won't even see this. It'll be, it'll be on top. So it'll look like factory. All right, guys, thank you.